I'm out here in Gallatin, Tennessee on Hartsville Pike State, Tennessee State Route 25. As you can see, we've got an abandoned crossing with some Aramar and Cantilevers at it. No emergency information on the signals with dot numbers on the radio case over there. I'll show it later. First signal here is a Lincoln Industries cantilever. The mast lights are Safe Tran 12 by 24 inch lights that are completely incandescent. The overhead lights are front only and they are also Safe Tran 12 by 24 inch incandescent lights. I'll show the back shortly. Right there's a General Signals Type 1 electronic bell. Wait, I think it's Type 1, I'm not sure if it's Type 1 or Type 2. Either way, it's a General Signals electronic bell, but the fading reminds me a lot of a General Signals Type 1, so I'm thinking it's a General Signals Type 1. Up there, as you can see, they are Safe Tran. There's more Safe Tran lights. Then over here, I'm going to quickly cross the road. We've got the other signal that I'm going to get a back shot of real quick. I'm also out here with Ethan the rail fanner. As you can see, this one right here is a Lincoln Industries cantilever as well. Then we got more Safe Tran 12 by 20 inch, 24 inch incandescent lights. There's a look back. And then the overhead lights here, of course, are more Safe Tran 12 by 24 inch incandescent lights. Here is another. Here's a look at the backs of these guys. Of course, again, of course, these are front only. There's the General Signals electronic bell up there. Now over here is the relay case. And as you can see, the dot number there is 343828A. They've got to stop this mount close clearance sign there, because right there is the end of this uh, little spur at the end of this branch line here. Looks like the branch line is originally continued further down, but it's long dead. There's the end there. There's where it was hooked up, where cars got hooked up and stuff. There's the cut tracks. And on the other side there, as you can see, they also cut the tracks. So which is why this crossing is absolutely abandoned. I'm kind of impressed they'd abandoned such modern equipment, but that's life, I guess. But anyways, here is a... You know, this is an abandoned crossing in Gallatin, Tennessee. Over and out.